What up, people? We're in Brahms. We're in the drive Brahms drive-thru. I got a... Go, be up. I got number one burger and fries. What'd you get? Chicken strips. Because I'm driving strips. easy to dip and go. Man, I'm all decked out and shoot dang, and you're all decked out in cold beer? Yeah. But, uh... Well, okay. That hat, he said that was specifically for you since you didn't get one last time. Okay. Awesome. So I was going to take it no matter what. Yeah. Uh, I didn't want it anyways. What up, John? What up, Natasha? Uh, but we uh, just got back from the little trade days over there at Beeline Feed Store out in Mounds. Boy, did we clear house. Man, there was a lot of people there. Uh, Even more than last time. We pulled up, and I mean, it was a big uh, turnout this time, and uh, it's fun meet some subscribers, met some new ones. Uh, met some that we met last time. If you go over to my main channel, you can see on the community tab, uh, two young viewers. It was awesome meeting them. Uh, they had a they have a bone disease, I believe, is what yeah. the grandma was saying. And uh, we walked up, and the little boy instantly ran up and just gave me a big hug. I thought that was pretty funny. Uh, well, he hugged me too, but he didn't hug Danielle. I think he was a little nervous. Uh -huh. The grandma like apologized. She's like, "I'm sorry, he ran up and hugged us." I said, "That's fine." I said, "We're from the south. That's what people do." Uh, they're probably a uh, I don't even know eight years old maybe the boy, and then the girl's yeah. probably like five or something. Hold on, we're getting our food. But, uh, yeah, they gave us a an animal. It's in the back of the truck right now in a kennel. And then Jason bought something to go with it. So you'll probably yeah. have to watch that on what channel? The Crockers. Oh, The Crockers. And uh, Hello, how you doing? Good, how are you? Pretty good. Ooh, star. Thank you, man. Thank you. Yeah, Thank a good one. Thank you. But, uh... Oh yeah, it's gonna be some good stuff. I'm starving. But yeah, we picked up those, which you'll see on the other channels. Uh, I think they'll be a, a huge part of uh, Shoot Dang Ranch. I didn't get situated here. And uh, what'd you get? Chicken and fries. Ooh. I haven't had Brahms fries in a while. Where's my chicken? This. Oh man, I don't know how I'm gonna do with all this. It's pretty good. Well, you have like 50 cup holders. So we're in uh, the oh. like, the new used truck, and uh, Danielle's not with us. She went to a I baby need, shower. I need my brain. Oh, so she's in my car right now. We had to use the truck to haul the animals around. They're right here. But uh, yeah, we're heading back to Shoot Dang Ranch right now to let these animals out. And I survived my first night inside the pop up camper. It, and it's, it rained a little bit. It did rain. It rained quite a bit. Uh, there was a little bit of wind. It wasn't too bad. It did shake a little here and there, but uh, it's nothing hot. too crazy. Those fries are good. But don't put your elbow in my gravy. We just got back from Harbor Freight as well. I was going to pick up a generator like Jason's, but they didn't have any. So we do have a small generator there at the property. Jason bought a little attachment for it. So I'm probably gonna try to use that and see what all it can run on the uh, in the camper. I think you said it can run the heater, but it has to be on low. Yeah. Um, and then I have the Ocmo battery bank and then the Jackery one in there. So that should be able to power all that stuff. It's fresh and hot. Yeah. You know? And I'll probably be doing a an outside shower, bathroom, and kitchen area here soon. Uh, I did order a USB. Uh, shower it's a portable shower i think it comes with a little bucket like a seven gallon bucket or something and we got a soldering gun so you'll be able to fix your mine won't have heat in it well you can still come shower in it huh you can still come shower with it oh but i don't know if i need to heat up water i can eat i mean i could just go uh heat up some water on a fire and you need to take that bucket. little uh fast water heater thing Oh yeah, I forgot. That's what we did last night. We heated water with it and took a hand bath. Well, so, wash our faces. I could do that. Just it get boiling water, pour that inside the other gallon with the cold water, and it, it gets hot. So I mean, hot. A viewer sent us that. It's like a instant hot water thing. I don't know, but it's awesome. She said she she bought that and bought us a bunch of ramen noodles, which we love. Um, yeah, and the first time y'all did that, y'all used it. It got hot. It got hot quick. So I didn't think about that, so I might have to do that. But I'm planning on building a little room 
not room, like an outdoor area behind the, the trailer that'll kind of block me off from them. Uh, so I can go poo poo and shower and stuff outside and not be seen by the world. But I did hear a coyote last night. It was really, really close. Probably the closest I've ever heard them out there. And of course the dog started barking and I didn't hear it again. So that's a good thing for the dogs to be out there. But you can talk real quick so I can eat these fries. Mm. Hello. Hello. Oh, are you still there? Um, I'm just trying to make sure I don't miss this. Oh. We're using a uh, handheld stand for the camera, so it's kind of shaky. But, yeah, um, we do have some stuff. Like we said, we got stuff from a viewer, and then um, we got something ourselves. Uh, I did. I wanted that this. Good. Yeah, don't be eating all my gravy. I put a one fry in there. Uh, I've been wanting this, and then Danielle as well, clearly Jared, but uh, before we got it, I just said, all right, is this what you want? Are you cool with this? She the first said, one yeah, was, so. I guess, the first one. Huh? The two animals, the first one you're talking about. Obviously, the, the same thing, but... I'm talking about the second one. Oh. Well, you had talked to this person who gave us the uh, the picture on my community tab and said that the little boy, they're having to get rid of it because... She's having surgery. She's having surgery. It's going to be hard for him to take care of stuff. And the little boy, what did he say? He'd only rehome it if it was to Jared. So, shout out to you, Jackson, for the, uh, and Elizabeth, for the, uh, animal. Yeah. And what I thought was cool was he's addicted to Jared's channel. Yeah, that's said if his name, or if his, if his name or his voice will come running in. But the grandma likes off the clock, and that's. That's, that's adult time. That's her adult time to watch that channel. Yeah, just because we don't filter everything on there. But on mine, she said, uh, on my main channel, whenever I do say a bad word, pop off a cuss word, that the little, what does he say? I forgot. She said the little boy makes like a, a like, like uh oh or something. Some kind of noise, which was funny. And I said, maybe I should clean up my act a little bit. But it does stay on the road, bro. It does put it in perspective when you meet people that watch your videos. This was probably one of the younger ones I've met. And we met them last time. And uh, all the way up to, I mean, we've had grandmas and old ladies. And when I call you old ladies, it's nothing bad. Well, it was like last time we had people show up that were about our parents' age that said that their parents watch Why not try? but couldn't make it. So, I mean, literally, on the whole spectrum of ages. Yeah, but I guess once we get back, we'll let the animals out just see how they interact with everybody else. We do have a electric fencing we're gonna be putting up yeah. to make sure that it keeps all these animals inside. And uh, yeah, that's basically gonna be the day today. It's kind of like a an off day. Yeah, and we kind of clean up around there and stuff like that, so. We are gonna have a, a guest go out into the property. I'm probably not gonna say who, because I don't know if y'all are gonna announce on another channel. We talked about it um, on Top of the Crack. Danielle's dad's going out there. I wish it was her mom, but. And that's the first person, oh. And then a lady came up. It's like, can I get a picture with you? That's right. I said, yeah, absolutely. And so um, she's like, I'm Tracy's wife, the one that delivered your tractor. And I was like, what? I thought it was cool. Yeah, so she uh, took a picture just to be like, look who I saw. I so, was cool. Shout out to you, Tracy, for yeah. delivering that tractor once again. Heck yeah. But yeah, I guess I'm hungry. I need to eat. I just figured I'd put out a video right now or at least film it now, post it later around 5 o'clock today. So uh, stay tuned for that. Stay tuned for a lot of building coming up. I'm going to be doing my campsite area first, and then I'm going to start doing the tiny house, and then you guys are going to be starting that very soon too, y'all, because we had to get the stuff rock and roll. Yep. So anyways, hope you guys have a great day. We're going to finish our food and head back to the thing ranch, and we'll catch you on the next one. Peace. Bye, people.